Uh, you know what? Let's swap to a more expensive arrow just to try to end this. There we go. 10 piercing, 4 acid, and 18 piercing. I... Was that sneak attack damage? I honestly don't know why there's piercing there twice unless the second one is sneak attack damage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm scared! Mukluk is now dying and has lost concentration on summon spiders. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, healing word on him, get him standing again. And Noxie's gonna go over here and just start bow flexing in this guy's face, which is, uh, you know, very scary. Um, try to get him lower with a cantrip. Oh, he's just dead, okay. Bow flex successful. All right, we got two archers remaining. Tell chat all of them. Oh. Ow! Clam and Mug are gonna have very fragmented memories of this fight. Um. Okay, he's not in cover. Oh god. You think with the leader dead, they would run away? I mean, where would they run? Actually, you know what? Dire wolves. A crit! Oh! 10 and 2. No sneak attack, though, because uh, nothing was nearby. I think with a bow, he only gets a sneak attack when he shoots something that is uh, engaged in melee combat. Noxie commence the flex! Uh... I still don't understand why Guardian of Faith didn't really work. I don't want to use Guiding Bolt just in case I need that last heal. So let's Sacred Flame cantrip. Miss, or it was resisted. Alright, he takes 16 Radiant at the start of his turn. And Clam is now dying. Okay, he hits a summoned animal. That's good. That's better than him swinging at one of us. He gets a crit. Dude, this guy gets three attacks a turn. What? Uh, Clam is trying to roll to live. Um, let's see. Let's do a bonus spell, healing word. He can do that from a distance. I just need to heal at least one health to get him not dying. And then we can... You cannot see this target. I still can't see that target. Okay, go to this corner. I think that should work. Venna... Still no? Alright, climb up top. This is gonna have him be wide open, and I don't like that, but hopefully the guy will just stare at the wolves. Nice, he's dead. Okay, wonderful. Alright, can you shoot... Wait, who's left? Oh, the Dark Weaver. This is a long shot, literally. Oh, four and two, a little bit of damage. It still takes like half damage. Pick up the powerful cantrip trait will make your cantrips do half hit resist. I, is that in this game? I don't know that I've noticed powerful cantrip. Um, I don't think he's in the bubble, so I am going to Wait, why can't I dash closer? Wait, there we go. Okay. There we go. He takes seven radiant. It's her for ten. Three piercing from the wolf. Try to punch. Miss. Clam crossbow, critical hit for 13, 
And another hit for 10 and 7. This is going to be out of range. Yeah, he can see it, but it's out of range. The leap! Hmm, okay. Ready a cantrip. Yeah, I I have no memory of seeing the cantrip you described. That does sound good, but I, I don't, I'm not sure if that's in this game. Or if that's just in 5e. If it is in the game, then I've overlooked it. Sacred Flame. Dead. Victory! Oh, boy. Cutscene. That was... Uh, awkward. I'm sorry. That Warrock. What an asshole. It was a long time ago, but I guess it's some kind of closure. <laughs> well, our rock already died on the way here, so I guess that's that. Why didn't Oxy apologize? Because... Uh, the quest was basically that these guys burned down Mukluk's village as a child. So I think it was she was apologizing because of just the circumstances. Mana Colin Key. I uh, don't have another one of those today. Now, I have not used, um, any of this. Is it worth using any of these? 2d6 plus 3. 2d6 plus 4. 1d8 plus 4. Poison Web, Tiger Drake. Tiger Drake does a bit of damage. I don't know if that's I don't know if that's worth uh putting away the cantrips and doing it. I'm pretty sure powerful cantrips is a feat. Well, if I get another uh level up, I will check. The I did make sure to get Muck and Noxy the better oh, was it flawless concentration, which has been pretty good. Uh nicely crafted boots. Do any of you veterans know if there is a way to um, identify stuff, like with a merchant, if you don't have anyone in your party who can identify? I found the target, gather the party, and wait behind the necropolis. We'll be there soon, and I'll have my revenge, Orok. Well, I guess there's our evidence, because <laughs> Orok's already dead, though. Uh, Alright, let's do a short rest. Just to get some health back. Okay. Weapon rack. Superb great axe. Your people have, like, no armor? Um... I mean, they've got armor, but I've not found any magical items, or I have some and I don't, don't know how to identify them. I googled how to identify the magic items in this game, and it said it was, like, a level 1 wizard spell. I don't have a wizard. And... or... it said that it was, like, um... there was a certain domain of cleric that could do it, and I don't have that domain. So... That's why I was asking if you could have a merchant do it and stuff. Like, in pen and paper, I could tell the dungeon master, can I just pay a fee to have someone in town do this? And he's like, oh, yeah, sure. And then da-da-da-da-da-da, and, and then that's it. You can have a merchant do it. Okay, then I guess I need to do that. 
Um, okay, I think I'm done in this area. Let's head back to the to the entrance. Detect magic first on cleric. Uh, I think I I don't know if I've got it learned and ready to like ready to lock and load right this second. I think my druid might have that. I'll check in a minute. I'll check in a moment. Okay, so that quest is done. So, let's see. There's a guy over here to talk to. Let's see what this is about. Klitschkeist to you, Sarge. You too. What can I do for you today, my friend? I need the keys to my house in the Vale. Mildred told me. Oh, it's you. You've grown. Well, of course you have. Here, take this note to the archivist. Thanks, Sarge. You can get a one to detect magic too, but Clarice can ritual cast it without using a spell slot. Let me see if I have it ready to go. Not currently, no. Alright, so I'll have to try to do that uh, when I rest. Uh, general store for adventurers. Well met. What can we um, so what do you Okay. Um How do we So somebody there's something wrong with ANET. We need to help them they advertise their game. Do you believe that at Josh Starface channel? Uh yeah, and then Josh uh, said that the last expansion was coming out. Even though they've said repeatedly, "Into Dragons" is not the last expansion, it it, it hurts me. It, it happened not just with Josh, but with another guy too. So whoever paid Josh and the other people to do the advertising did not give them a few very important bullet points. Your face is covering it. My face is covering it. Um. I mean, hold on. Boom. All right. I mean, I'm looking, not sure what I need here. Bottom left? What? Where did Mutt go? I, I hit it because I'm looking for this stupid identification thing. Another vendor. Oh, so I'm not covering it then. It's not even here. You suck. I don't even know who I'm looking for. So there may or may not be someone in this town who can or cannot identify the stuff in my inventory that may or may not be magical. All right. Let's teleport to the other town. Apparently, Josh Strife Hayes was also approached by Blizzard to promote their expansion a while back. He just said no, but that money turns out a good product. Dude, I I was approached to advertise a New World, and I, I this was before it exploded on itself. It was after it was destroying video cards, but before it did all the other crap. And they were like, you know, we, would, could we pay you to advertise New World? And I was like, I'm sorry, I've already made it quite clear. I'm not interested in that game, and I don't want to go back on that. <laughs> I said no. <laughs> Drosony gifting a sub to Korg Snowstrider. Thank you, buddy. My client Douglas about thought of you, Reginald Esquire, the fourth is the time to festivals. The third goal was you. Drosony's gift a sub to Korg Snowstrider and Wildflower to the lap. Hope you enjoy our say entertainment is on the way. Crank up the speakers, don't touch the speakers. Giveaways every week. Please take a seat, but you'll only need the edge. Mm. Welcome. Evening, Mark. Hello, here. 
It's amazing that a game that makes you pay in-game taxes has its economy breaking all the time. <laughs> yeah. All right. This is the area with, like, magical stuff. If there is an identification merchant, I'm guessing it's here somewhere. Deputies, do you have any... Take a look. Oh, she'll, like, pay us for this stuff? Yeah, sure. I... Whatever. Stay in the light. Love me. Wait, I wasn't done. Deputies. We do. Ah, uh, here we go. Detect magic. Detect magical auras on all items carried by party members. Does not reveal the item's function. New items have been revealed as magical on Mucklet, Clam, Noxie, and Chat. Ring of Poison Resistance. Chainmail plus one. This is going to cost a lot of money. Ring of the Lightbringers. Boots of Striding and Springing. Ring of Necrotic Resistance. Great Axe plus one. Oh my gosh, I had so much stuff I was carrying around. <laughs> Bolt plus one. Have I said hello yet this evening? What's up, Cezanne? Great Sword plus one. Okay. Wait, so when I identified one item, it identifies all items of the exact same type, it seems? I bought more gems. <laughs> Why do you say that with a sad face? Be proud of your gems. Alright, what does this do? Uh, can walk on walls, cannot be restrained by webs, can pass without a trace, one charge. Uh, uh, resistance to poison. Can walk on walls. Thinking Noxy because she's the main damage dealer right now. Where's her invent? Oh my god, it bugged out. Oh, not even a graphic. Boo. Uh, resistance to poison damages have. Doesn't this already mean? Yeah, we've already got that on another character. All right. Um. Chainmail plus one. Leather armor plus one. Oh boy, we're gonna have to <laughs> It's an upgrade. Oh my gosh, that bulge. Yeah, okay, we're we're gonna David Bowie our way into the wilderness. Chainmail plus one, him, leather armor plus one, him. What is the ring? Uh cash shine. Three out of three per dawn. Um Sure, why not? Okay, so he's gotten... Oh, he already had Chainmail plus one. All right. Uh, Greatsword plus one. Did I have any plus one one-handed weapons? Oh, he appears to not have any arrows ready to go either. Or crossbow bolts. Corrosive bolts right there. Uh, scale mail, 14. Did I have a scale mail plus one? Wait, she's got a handy haversack. She's not even using it. Noxy, what the heck? There's scale armor plus one. All right, let's try this. Okay, that's an upgrade. Oh, that looks kind of neat with a weird little blue etching. Okay, you, uh, he's already got leather armor plus one, good. Great sword plus one, arrows, speaking of arrows. Uh, boots of striding and springing can jump at max distance without risk, unaffected by encumbrance penalties, unaffected by heavy armor penalties. 
Uh, well, I know who is our best jumper and heavy armor person. That's you! So I got no plus one one-handed weapons. Very unfortunate. Uh, the next person in heaviest armor would be Noxie. We've got a lot of item attuning to do the next time we rest. Okay. Our party discovers magical items. Save game. All right. Where was our house? I'm trying to remember where our house is. It was one of the embassies. Clear skies, my friends. You have some treasure in your back. Feast your eyes on this. <laughs> he sounded drunk. Uh, yeah, time, get, here, take all this stuff. I don't care. Love me. Uh, here's your eyes on this. Gallivan Embassy. Where was my freaking house? Travel interrupted. Don't interrupt me. Who goes there? I'd like to see Ambassador Crawley. We do? Cancel business? <laughs> hmm. Follow me. Just like that. Shut up and follow. I think this was regarding chat's past. Did he pay her? I think it was a, a note. It might have been a bribe. I thought it was like a letter he received or something. I'll be damned. Senior deputy of the Legacy Council. Nice to see you, too. Can't say I expected your visit. I bumped into Belmont at the palace residence. And? He seems to suspect me over the stolen treaty plans. Seems to? He's pretty eager to pin it on me. I can't let that happen. That's why I'm here. Them? So, the way that chat has been behaving and, like, using code words and stuff and testing people makes it seem like he used to be a spy or something. Friends. Trustworthy. You have to take him out. I can't suggest a course of action. You just need to plant something in the New Empire's embassy. Oh, is that all? Unless you have friends in the Silent Whisper. I might. Once it's in the right hands, this will kill our friend Belmont's credibility. Oh, it looks like you have this all figured out. I always plan for every contingency. We should go. This guy's Batman half well, This time, it's farewell for good. Sounds like we got a quest to go do spy stuff. Long load. With Castlevania, I'm surprised they chose to use the name Belmont Salasta. Nah. You really want to break into the new Empire's embassy? This is crazy. We could ask Dalliot. I think he'll help us. Okay. Our search for our house continues. It's so crazy. I've lost my freaking house. That's not it. Did I, do I have to zone out of the city to get there? I mean, I guess I can rest on the road. Ah, what a bother. Uh, okay. Get your sword and shield back in your hand. Get your daggers back in hand. And let's go down to the scavengers. Seagull to Dudor is my car, Dudor is my house. I mean, basically right now. I 
Okay, nothing, nothing scavenger related to do there. Okay. Um. All right. Let's go. Let's go find the the next objective. We can we can rest on the road. Wait, it says I've got a quest here. What do I need to do? Shadow of the past. Oh, that, I guess that's. Uh, let me read it. Let me see what it says. Talk to Daliot to get rid of Belmont. Find the secret entrance to the New Empire's embassy and sneak inside. Uh, I want to work on the main quest line right now. Um, there's something in Copper Room. Active Family Reckoning? What was that? Get the keys from the archivist uh, in the Keep's basement. Ask for the keys to your house to the Veil. All right, that's Clam's Pass. Runs in the family. Is retrieve an item from the ruins around the fortress. Uh, he'll pay you. Okay, that's a side quest also. Where is something related to the main freaking story? The Collector. Uh, scavengers have reported the sigil of the Pure Forest have been found in the ruined output. He'll pay you. Okay. Uh, find the gems leads. Do I have another lead for the gems at all? Oh, wow. Way over here. Okay. A volcano and a lava forest. I guess that was it. Okay, so let's... We can teleport here. And then go northwest from there. Alright. Remember to prep detect magic whenever... Yeah, next time I get to do a rest somewhere, I'll do it. For those using Samsung Cloud, uh, back up your data. The drives are being wiped on the 29th. Why the heck would they do that? I'm not using Samsung Cloud. That sounds bad for business to do that thing you said, though. Uh, yeah. Lava forest or the volcanoes and the trees? Maybe. Maybe the trees shoot lava. I don't know. Same thing with Google Drive. Wait, are you saying they're wiping Google Drive on the 29th? I use Google Drive a lot. I have not gotten any notifications of that. What? I just stepped outside. I don't even know what I'm in combat with. Wait, these guys? Are you serious? I I freaking like own this castle. Can I just leave? Uh, this is awkward. Move. I don't. I think I outlevel these dudes, but you own the castle. Well, I mean, I literally just teleported to it, stepped outside, and then they're like, "Hey, what are you doing? What's all this now?" Out of range. Out of range. I can't. Six damage. Like, look at that. The guys inside can't even reach us. <laughs> They're just standing there. They can't do anything. Oh, man. What a dumb fight. Yeah, I haven't rested yet. Can I just, like, run? I'm wondering if I get everyone up here, if I can just zone out of the area. I'm literally fighting with skeletons that don't know how to open a door, that are on the other side of a door. Oh, wait. Are they going to discover door? Or just walk up to it and stare at it? Oh, this one is spry. 
there's a bunch of them. I feel like I'm playing an XCOM mission. I'm just trying to get everybody to the evac point. I'm not even positive if it'll work or not. 